wears her hair up in a bun and she's got a gang of stars on her phone. Captain Stacy Spell with the Los Angeles Police Department's Media Relations Division. In a moment, I'm going to introduce uh, Sheriff Alex Villanueva, as well as Captain uh, Mendoza from the Sheriff's Homicide Bureau, as well as Chief Michael Moore. Um, so and then we'll be uh, able to answer some questions in Spanish also if they're Spanish media. Thank you. Hello, I'm uh, Captain uh, Joe Mendoza, Los Angeles County Sheriff's Homicide Bureau. Uh, tonight, at, a at approximately uh, 9 16, deputies from Century Station received a call of a gunshot victim at, on the 1700 block of East 87th Street. When deputies arrived, that's when they learned that there had been a gunshot victim in the alley between Graham and Beach just south of 87th Street. That victim was suffering from at least one gunshot wound. They were, they were able to help that victim into the back of a radio, radio car where they came here to St. Francis. Uh, that male uh, was treated here at St. Francis Medical Center and later pronounced deceased. That male is an LAPD off-duty officer and that's all the information that we have regarding uh, the officer at this time. The other information that we've learned through this investigation was that the officer, the off-duty officer was on 87th Street when he was confronted by three male Hispanics. One of those male Hispanics was armed with a handgun and this led to an officer involved shooting where the officer was hit. The three male Hispanics fled in a black truck, and that is all the information that we have at this time. This information, this uh, investigation is just in its infancy, it just started, and we want to reach out to the public. If they have any information, to please call LA County Sheriff's Homicide at 323 890 5500. They can also uh, leave any tips at Crime Stoppers. So we're looking to identify the suspects the suspect vehicle and uh, just before I end I just wanted to uh, give my condolences to LAPD to all their officers their family and uh, we are working with LAPD on this uh, and we will be have more information as uh, the night progresses now I'd like to introduce uh, Chief Moore Captain Mendoza thank you Tonight, Los Angeles grieves as we experience the loss of a young officer who was off duty with a companion and in a neighborhood looking to a bright future. Very limited information we have at this point, but it appears that he encountered three individuals and gunfire was exchanged. This officer suffered those wounds. I want to thank the Los Angeles Sheriff's Department. They responded quickly to the scene. And recognizing the grievous injuries that this officer had sustained, loaded him up in a black and white patrol unit and rushed him to this hospital. And despite the valiant efforts of St. Francis and their medical professionals, our officer died as a result of his, of his injuries. We're not identifying this officer by name at this point. Uh, we have still notifications to make for his next of kin. I'd ask the media to not identify. I recognize that there's a, a, some additional information that's been uh, leaked to the press or has been, uh, been learned by the press. I'd ask again that you not uh, announce this officer's uh, identity at this point. Give us a few more hours so that we can make every effort to notify his next of kin and we can give them that respect and that dignity. I want to thank the Los Angeles Sheriff's Department, their major crimes, bureau, their homicide, Command. They have brought the full force of the Los Angeles Sheriff's Department to 
Bear, Captain John Tippett from our Robbery Homicide Division, our Force Investigation Division, those detectives have also responded and are supporting the Sheriff's Department in their criminal investigation. We do believe that we have an officer involved shooting here that our officer exchanged gunfire with at least one of these suspects. We do have our officer's gun and we have an additional weapon that we believe is responsible for this assault. We are very limited as far as information we have, but we know that we need the community's help. And we also have every faith and confidence that we'll identify the person or persons responsible for this, this terrible attack and this grievous loss. Thank you for being here tonight. That's all I have at this point. We'll have more information in the coming hours. Thank you. Thank you. All right, thank you. That's going to conclude this uh, this briefing. Uh, Captain Spillow, will you be taking any questions this evening? Yeah, not, not this evening. Not yet. We will have more information later, hopefully. Thank you. Thanks, guys.